little artist, I'm Mariana Olson, and today we are drawing an Easter Bunny. Are you ready? Let's do this! Okay, we're gonna need paper, something to color with, I'm using markers, and something to draw with. I will use a black marker that you can change for a pencil. We're gonna start folding the paper in half, then we're gonna take the bottom part and fold in half again. Now we're gonna flip it over and fold one more time, and then we're gonna open it, you're gonna flip it, and we're gonna start drawing right here. Hello little artist, today we're gonna draw a bunny in a basket that is gonna be for Easter, and I hope you like this lesson. Let's start on the outside part. I'm gonna leave about four finger space, and I'm gonna put here a little line underneath the folding part. And on the other side the same, we're gonna do four fingers and a line that goes down. And now we're gonna rotate the paper and we're gonna join these two lines. Just like that. And now let's leave here about a finger space and we're gonna go down and we're gonna curve on the corner. The next here, about a finger space, going down and curving on the corner. And now I'm gonna rotate my paper again and try and join these two lines, okay? The texture of the basket, we're gonna do it at the end with the color, so just stay to see how we do that. We're gonna do now the bunny ears that are going in behind the basket or inside the basket. So over the folding part, I'm gonna start doing a upside down letter U, and it comes down here to the middle of the basket. Inside, I'm gonna do another U shape, just like this. Now we're gonna start here on the corner again. We're gonna go up, and then we're gonna start coming down, kinda like in a diagonal line, and remember, we're leaving a space in the middle, and we're gonna do one more inside. Now, if you'll notice, the ears are a little pointing to the outside. They're not straight, they're pointing out. That's it for the outside part. Now let's open the paper. And let's finish the ears first. We're gonna cross here the folding part going down. And we're gonna stop about the half of this folding part. And let's work on the outside lines. And we're gonna finish this at the same distance. And in between these two lines, I'm gonna do a curve line. And I'm gonna go up a little and do this curve line. And now that I have this one, I can finish the rest of the ears by going down and joining here, going down. And you should have a little bit of a space here in the middle. Now let's do the second lines here the same. Now let's finish the head and we're gonna go down, crossing the folding part and coming down again. So we're gonna curve on the folding part, cross, and going down again. Let's do one more time. Going down, get to the folding part, and curve again, okay? Now, if you notice here, the space here between the head and the basket is small. So we're gonna do a small body. We're gonna start by doing a curve. It's little in each side. And the little bit of a space that gets here, we're gonna do long feet. They go and curve and make sure not to cross the folding part. We're gonna go down and curve. And I miss this part going in a little. And to make it look more like feet, we're gonna do here one curve inside that goes in. Now this bunny is holding a little Easter egg, so we're gonna start by doing the hands on this part. We're gonna do a curve, kind of like a backwards letter C, and a letter C on the other side. And in the middle, we're gonna do the egg by doing a half an oval shape. And on the bottom, we're gonna do a half a circle, just like that. On top of the egg, we're gonna start doing the face. We're gonna do two U shapes for his mouth. And I'm passing my marker twice just to make this line thicker. Next to the mouth, we're gonna do two oval shapes for the eyes. And here too. Now let's fill these oval shapes with black. And there, 
that's it. We finished this bunny. There is an Easter bunny. Let's check how it looks when we close it. And this is how it looks when we open. I hope you like this lesson. And now my favorite part is coming. Let's color. Okay, little artist, we are done. This is how my picture looks in the outside. Here for the basket, we start with a light color and then with a darker color, we did this pattern. And remember, you can add more things in the outside like Easter eggs. Now let's check how it looks when we open. Here's my Easter bunny. I add some more details in the background like the Easter eggs and these carrots. But remember, you can change all these elements using your imagination. So, if you like this video, don't forget to subscribe to the channel so you don't miss lessons step by step like this one. See you next time!